It's tea time. It's tea time. Uh, it's tea time. It's tea time. Hey, what's up? It's your girl, Tammy Bonner, and I'm stopping by to give my NBA Finals prediction of who's going to win. And I think it's a no-brainer. I think the Cavs are going to win. I don't even expect this to go to a Game 7. I think the Cavs are going to end this in about a 5 or 6 game series. They're both phenomenal teams. They're both stacked as far as names are concerned on their roster. However, the thing that separates them is that the Cavs are multidimensional. They can shoot. They can get to the basket. They have creators. They have an inside presence with Tristan Thompson. And they have a bench. Okay? The problem with the Warriors are they brought in Kevin Durant, who's a phenomenal name, phenomenal shooter, um, 6'11", can shoot over a lot of guys, but he's still just that, a shooter. He did not make them multidimensional, and that's the problem that the Warriors are going to run into. Who do you go to when you need an easy bucket in the paint? You don't have anybody that you can go to, and that right there is what is going to separate the two teams drastically. Not anything close is going to be a drastic separation just based off that one factor. We all heard the term, you live by the three, you die by the three. And this year, I hate to say it, the Warriors are going to die by it. I actually hope that my prediction is so wrong because I am a Warriors fan. I'm actually an Oakland native, born and raised. You feel me, bruh? But, nonetheless, I have to be a realist based off of what I know about the game of basketball. Cavs in five or six. It's tea time. It's tea time. Uh, it's tea time. It's the